We're here in New Orleans, a city that knows a thing or two about hardship and hustle. From the French Quarter to the Ninth Ward, you'll find folks chasing their dreams, some with more in their pockets than others. Building wealth isn't about hitting the lottery or inheriting a fortune from your long-lost uncle. It's about the habits you build, the choices you make every single day. So buckle up, because we're about to embark on a journey to financial freedom. Let's talk about the first habit paying yourself first. Before you even think about paying bills or buying that fancy latte, you set aside a portion of your income for savings and investments. Think of it as paying your future self. Most folks get their paycheck and start spending, but the wealthy do things differently. They prioritize their financial goals and pay themselves first. Even $50 a week adds up over time. 60% of millionaires credit this one habit as a key to their success. So take a good hard look at your budget. Trust me, your future self will thank you. All right, let's talk about debt. The silent wealth killer lurking in the shadows, it creeps up on you slowly but surely and before you know it, you're drowning. Sometimes a little bit of debt can be a tool like when you're starting a business or buying a house. These are investments that can potentially grow your wealth. But the kind of debt I'm talking about is the kind that sucks you dry. It's the high interest credit card debt, the payday loans, and the unnecessary personal loans. The wealthy understand that this kind of debt is like a ball and chain around their ankles. It restricts their freedom and limits their financial growth. They avoid it like the plague. They know that every dollar spent on interest is a dollar that could have been invested or saved. Instead of racking up credit card bills, they live within their means. They budget carefully and make sure they spend less than they earn. They'd rather drive a used car they paid cash for than a fancy sports car with a hefty monthly payment. They understand that appearances can be deceiving. They'd rather save up for a down payment on a modest home than stretch themselves thin to buy a McMansion. They prioritize financial stability over showing off. So if you're serious about building wealth, you gotta get serious about ditching debt. Start by cutting up those credit cards and consolidating your debt. Start living a debt-free life. Imagine the freedom and peace of mind that comes with not owing anyone anything. It's a journey worth taking. Now let's talk about a habit that goes hand in hand with avoiding debt, living below your means. Some folks think being wealthy is about flashing your cash and buying all the latest gadgets. But the truly wealthy, they know better. Living below your means doesn't mean living like a pauper. It simply means being mindful of your spending and making sure your outgo doesn't exceed your income. Every dollar you spend is a choice between investing in your future or indulging in the moment. The wealthy are always thinking long term. Building wealth is a marathon, not a sprint. Chapter 4. Invest like a pro building a solid financial future. In this chapter, we will explore the key principles that can help you become a successful investor and secure your financial future. Investing does come with risks, but it also comes with incredible rewards. The potential for growth and financial independence is what makes investing so appealing. The wealthy know that investing isn't gambling. It's about putting your money to work for you. They understand the importance of making informed decisions and leveraging their resources wisely. They take the time to educate themselves and diversify their portfolio. Education is a crucial component of successful investing and continuous learning helps them stay ahead. They spread their investments across different asset classes like stocks, mutual funds, and exchange-traded funds, ETFs, bonds, real estate, and even precious metals. This diversification helps mitigate risks and ensures a balanced approach to wealth building. They understand that market fluctuations are inevitable, but a well-diversified portfolio can weather the storms. By spreading their investments, they reduce the impact of any single market downturn. They invest for the long haul, not looking for quick flips or get-rich-quick schemes. Long-term investing allows for compound growth, which can significantly increase wealth over time. Real wealth is built over time, through consistent investing and a disciplined approach. Patience and persistence are key to achieving financial success. So, if you're ready to start building real wealth, it's time to get serious about investing. Take the first step by setting clear financial goals and developing a strategic investment plan. Start putting your money to work for you. Remember, the journey to financial freedom begins with a single step, and the sooner you start, the better. I 
Chapter 5. The Eighth Wonder of the World. Harnessing the Power of Compound Interest. Albert Einstein called it the eighth wonder of the world, and for good reason. He recognized the incredible potential it holds for growing wealth over time. It's the closest thing to magic you'll find in the financial world. The way it works can seem almost mystical, but it's grounded in simple mathematics. Simply put, it's interest earned on interest. This means that not only does your initial investment earn interest, but the interest itself also earns interest. Over time, this compounding effect can turn a small investment into a significant sum of money. The longer you let it grow, the more powerful the effect becomes. The wealthy understand this principle intimately. They leverage it to build and maintain their fortunes, ensuring their money works for them. They know that the earlier they start investing, the more time their money has to compound and grow. This is why they often begin their investment journeys early in life. They're starting in their 20s and 30s, even if it's just with small amounts. These early investments can grow substantially over the decades. Time is their greatest asset when it comes to compound interest. The more time you give your investments, the more they can grow exponentially. Start investing today, even if it's just a small amount. Every little bit counts and can make a big difference in the long run. The sooner you start, the more time your money has to work its magic. Don't wait. Let compound interest help you achieve your financial goals. Chapter 6. Time is money. Build wealth and live life on your terms. The wealthy understand that time is more valuable than money. They prioritize their time, guarding it fiercely and using it wisely. They're focusing on activities that bring them joy and move them closer to their goals. They leverage their time by outsourcing tasks that can be done by others. They create passive income streams so their money is working for them even while they sleep. They're building businesses, investing in real estate, and creating multiple sources of income. They're not afraid to say no to commitments that don't align with their goals. They're intentional about how they spend their precious time. Chapter 7. Network Your Way to Success. Building Relationships That Matter. In the world of wealth building, it's not always about what you know, it's about who you know. The wealthy are master networkers, constantly building and nurturing relationships. They attend industry events, join professional organizations, and connect with people from all walks of life. They understand that every person they meet has the potential to open doors to new opportunities. They're generous with their own time and resources, always willing to lend a helping hand. Networking is a two-way street, and building strong relationships is about giving as much as you receive. They're active listeners, genuinely interested in the people they meet, Building a strong network is an ongoing process, not a one-time event. Chapter 8. Never Stop Learning. Knowledge is power and wealth. The wealthy are lifelong learners. They understand that the world is constantly changing, and to stay ahead they need to be constantly expanding their knowledge and skills. They're voracious readers, devouring books, articles, and industry publications. They attend seminars, workshops, and conferences, seeking out experts in their field. They're not afraid to invest in their education, whether it's pursuing advanced degrees or taking online courses. They surround themselves with other lifelong learners, creating a network of individuals who challenge and inspire them. Learning is a collaborative process, and bouncing ideas off others can lead to breakthroughs. Chapter 9. Protect Your Wealth. Shielding your assets from the unexpected. Building wealth is one thing, but keeping it safe and secure is another matter entirely. The wealthy understand that life is full of unexpected twists and turns, and they take steps to protect their assets. They work with experienced legal and financial professionals to create comprehensive estate plans. They establish trusts to protect their assets from creditors and potential legal challenges. They purchase adequate insurance coverage to mitigate the financial impact of unexpected events. They diversify their assets to minimize the impact of any single event. Protecting their financial information is just as important as protecting their physical assets. Chapter 10. The Gift of Giving Back. Creating a Legacy That Matters. Many wealthy individuals are incredibly generous and committed to making a positive impact on the world. They understand that true wealth isn't just about financial abundance, it's about using their resources to make a difference. 
They support causes they care about, whether it's funding medical research or providing educational opportunities. They establish foundations and charitable organizations, creating a lasting legacy. They volunteer their time, mentor young people, and use their platform to raise awareness about important issues. They find joy and fulfillment in making a difference. Giving back isn't just a moral obligation. It's a privilege and an opportunity to leave a lasting impact. Outro your journey to financial freedom starts today. There you have it, folks, the 10 habits of the wealthy. These habits might seem simple, but they're not always easy to implement. It takes discipline, commitment, and a willingness to change your mindset. Start implementing these habits today, one step at a time. The journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step.